ريزلت راح يعطي لي اوكي فاذا شلون فيزيولوجيكال تشينجز بريجنسي لها علاقه بالثايرويد فانكشن يوم الكوريون جونات تروفين هاز ثايروتروبيك اكتيفيتي بير هابس از ريزلت اوف الفا سب يونت هومولوجي وذ تي اس اتش يعني بيتا اس جي الى الالفا صب يونت مشابه لتي اس اتش اند ماتيرنال تي اس اتش بروتكشن ماي بي سبرست during the first trimester of a pregnancy when SCG level are maximum يعني شنو من SCG level عندنا maximum بال first trimester بما انه مشابه للالفا sub unit of TSH راح يكون اعاز الهايبوثالامس والبيوتري حتى يقللون شنو يقللون TSH protection بال first trimester ولذلك اذا سوينا TSH بال first trimester حنقول uh, حنلقاه uh, lower than the normal. Some have suggested a role of SCG or TSH in the nausea and vomiting often experienced by the normal pregnant women which usually improve after the first trimester. ولذلك شافوا انه نسبة محتمل ال SCG وال TSH اثنيناتهم نفس الرول مالت النوزيا والفوميتنج اني بريجنسي وايضا نرجع لهذا السبب من الى تشابههم بالالفا سب يونت. Some workers have reported a physiological increase in the site of thyroid gland in the pregnancy. بعض ال normally changes هذا اللي نحكي كله اللي نحكي normal changes. بعض الاحيان حنشوف اكو زياده بالحجم مالت الثيرويد جلاند رغم انه وظيفتها يعني وظائفها ايوثيرويد يعني طبيعيه لا هايبو ولا هايبر. بعض الزياده بالحجم بالجلاند مقبول دونك نورمال بريجنسي. Maternal AOD requirement increase because of active transport to the fetoplacenta unit and because of iodine excretion in the urine in the is increased. بسبب اليورن اوت فلو زاد وسبب الترانسبورت اكتف ترانسبورت اوف ذا اي او دي فروم ماتيرنال سيركيشن تو ذا فيتاس سو ديورنج ذا نورمال بريجنسي وي نيد مور اي او دي ريكوايرمنت تو ذا مادر ليش؟ ليه؟ بسبب اكتف ترانسبورت تو ذا فيتاس اللي يحتاجه اضافه المن الى النقطه الثانيه انه اكسكريشن الاي او دي باليورن زادت ليش؟ لان اليورن بلود فلو زاد Pregnancy associated with the marked increase in thyroid binding globulin and also found form of T4 and T3. يعني بما أنه thyroid binding globulin زاد due to pregnancy مثل أي globulin بال pregnancy increase its level. So معناها the bound form T4 T3 already will be increased normally. يعني شنو؟ إنه ال ال باوند تي 3 تي 4 نورمالي انكريز ديور البرونسي معناها نقدر نعتمد عليه بال بالقياس الثايرويد فانكشن تيست لا اذا علي وين راح نعتمد حتى نقول ذس نورمال ثايرويد فانكشن اور نوت نعتمد على الاكتف فورم اوف ذيس هرمون ليش؟ لانه ذيس التر ليست تغيرها جدا بسيط اورث ذي دو فول ان ذا ليتر ان ذا سكند اند ثيرد ترايمستر So in pregnancy, it is important to measure free T4, free T3, and to pay management. طبعا نعتمد عليها كأساس للpatient to diagnose as hypo or hyperthyroidism. واضح الحش شخصت يعني إذا patient نريدنا نقيسلها thyroid function test during the pregnancy. هندسها TSH free three. T T three free T four. ما راح ندرسها مثل أوساد بريكنسي for T S H T three T four اللي هو عادة يقيسون ال bound form اللي هو already increase. بينطينا hint in falsely إنه هو hyperthyroidism condition هو في حقيقة normal change physiological change in pregnancy. Okay. What about the fetal thyroid function by twelve to twelve? 11 to 12 weeks, the fetal thyroid is able to produce iodothyronin and T4. By 12 to 14 weeks, it is able to concentrate also iodine in uh, uh, fetal thyroid. Autonomous thyroid pituitary axis as early as 12 weeks gestation will be complete. 
يعني الفيتاس خلال 12 أسبوع even thyroid pituitary excess also will be completed and can uh, do automatically without need for the maternal thyroid after 12 weeks of gestation. So the first 12 weeks, it is important to you know, uh, be, uh, the condition of the th maternal thyroid should be your thyroid. Why? Because the development of the brain of the fetus depends on thyroxine from the mother. After 12 weeks, the thyroxine and iodine concentration will occur in the fetal thyroid and no need for the maternal thyroxine. هذه النقطة أوضح لكم إياها، أن بالثلاث أشهر الأولى الطفل development of the fetal growth and brain development يعتمدنا على thyroxine اللي come from the maternal circulation. ورا ال 12 أسبوع راح يعتمد على نفسه لأن كلها حيكون completed thyroid pituitary excess concentration of iodine in the fetal thyroid إضافة إلى protection of T3 and T4. هاي مقدمة بسيطة على physiological uh, changes during the pregnancy. What about hyperthyroidism? راح راح discuss in this lectures about hyper or hyperthyroidism in pregnancy. وشنو اللي effect of pregnancy on thyroid and the opposite effect the thyroid disease on the pregnancy outcome. About the hyperthyroidism, the incidence is one in five. Hundred pregnancies. It is usually due to grave disease. Grave disease or autoimmune thyroid toxicosis. Less than five percent of cases result from a toxic nodule or thyroiditis or carcinoma. And then, what is cause of hyperthyroidism in pregnancy? The most common cause it is autoimmune thyroid toxicosis or grave disease. كل كم تعرفون نسبة حدوثة باليانغ فيميل أكثر من حدوثة بأذر other age and other sex. About 5% of cases is the underlying cause of hyperthyroidism or toxic nodule and thyroiditis or carcinoma. Then, معناها 95% cause of hyperthyroidism in pregnancy or grave disease. If a pregnant, a pregnant woman present with hyperthyroidism and hyperemesis or molar pregnancy, so مولر بريجنسي ماست بي كونسيدرز يعني شنو؟ بعض هاي هاي ملاحظة بعض المرضى ممكن ان شنو يجونا هايبر ثايرويديزم هايبر ايميسيس اذا دول الاثنين حنشوف الكومبلين مالتهم محتمل نسوي افرا ساوند تكسكلود مولر بريجنسي اوكي؟ يعني المولر بريجنسي يجون هايبر ثايرويديزم وهايبر ايميسيس جرافيتا Growth disease tend to a remission during the pregnancy and an exacerbate during the postpartum period. أكثر مرضى يقول دكتورة إحنا من صرنا pregnant اختفت أعراض الهايبرثيروزم. But at the time of postpartum period, exacerbation of growth disease will be occur. Evidence suggests that increased immunological tolerance during pregnancy may lead to a decrease in thyroid antibodies to account for this remission. Even should the sebab and because there is an increased immunological tolerance, cell pregnancy, this lead to what? This lead to, to this remission. Even lo sa'anna. شو وقت حيكون exacerbation بالhyperthyroidism بالgrave disease كونه autoimmune حيكون exacerbation postpartum period and remission بالantipartum period What is the clinical feature of hyperthyroidism? As any hyperthyroidism of society pregnancy and even the clinical diagnosis of hyperthyroidism in pregnancy is difficult because many of signs and symptoms of hyperthyroidism and hyperdynamic circulation associated with this hyperthyroidism are present in normal eothyroid pregnant individual. هل هو تشخيص سهل اللي هو بيشت لنهائية ما مشخصة hyperthyroidism. During the pregnancy, أكو صعوبة. ليش؟ لأن the sign of symptom of hyperdynamic circulation 
اللي اسوشيت وذا هايبر ثايرويزم راح نلقاها موجوده محتمل بالنورمال يور ثايرويد بريكنت انديفيجوال مثلا نورمال فيسيولوجي بالبريكنسي ذير از انكريز بالبلس ريت اباوت 15 feet per minute. Okay. So, resting rate greater than 100 feet per minute that fell to the slow with Valzova maneuver. I change, lost weight, failure uh, to gain weight despite normal or increased food intake and heat intolerance are all helpful in making the clinical diagnosis. الفرق بين كريز البلس ريت هنا هنا اذا استخدمنا البلزوفا مانوفر فيل تو سلو بينما نورمال بيشنت اف يوز بلزوفا مانوفر البيت ويل بي لي تو ذا برادي كارديو تو فونديشن ان فور فيكال ستيمولاي اذر ساين لازم تو بي كلينيكال دايكنوز غير الهاي جريت او انكريز البيت بير مينيت ذير از اي تشينجز loss of weight اضافه لانه failure to what failure to gain weight رغم انه normal or increase for intake يقول ده اكل دكتور وده ينزل وزني ما ده نصعد نهائيا heat intolerance also may كلها يساعدنا for clinical diagnosis grave disease associated with the hyperplastic goiter and often with the exothalmus مثل ما قلنا اللي هو مضمن ال eye change A fetal tachycardia is commonly seen if the T4 level rises too high. شو وقت يصير change على ال fetal heartbeat وصير tachycardia إذا كان high level T4. Sequential measurement of the fetal heart rate is useful in clinical index. لازم إحنا دائما monitoring the fetal heart in patient with the hyperthyroidism. This clinically diagnosed. What about the biochemistry? Investigation. The initial screening test for pregnant women with possible hyperthyroidism including a serum free T4 and TSH. And elevated serum free T4 and suppressed TSH level establish the diagnosis of hyperthyroidism. Also, maybe also free T3 determinant may be need even to diagnose T3 thyrotoxicosis. Even serum. إن شو شو حنسوي لها investigation حندسها سيرم بري تي فور سيرم بري تي ثري أنتي إس إتش شو وقت ما يكون البري تي ثري بري تي فور هاي حنتوقع مقابلها يكون سبرس ثيرود سيميوتيك هرمون لفل تي إس إتش أوكي زين why we discuss this Hyperthyroidism pregnancy, because uncontrolled disease may lead to the maternal and fetal complication. Include the first one and the serious one is thyroid storm. Is the medical emergency present with the exaggerated feature of hyperthyroidism and decrease free T4 levels and hyperthermia, congestive heart failure. Alternator state, which is precipitated uh, either by infection or labor or cesarean delivery or non compliance with the medication. The maternal mortality exceeds 25% despite good medical management. So what about the specific treatment for this patient with storm? The first one, take blocking. Beta adrenergic activity with uh, propanol. Blocking secretion of thyroid hormone with sodium iodide. Blocking synthesis of thyroid hormone and conversion of T4 to T3 with 1,200 1, to 1,800 milligram probothiocene, giving in divided dots. Lowering the temperature by either ice bag and paracetamol, uh, replacing fluid loss with at least five liter of a fluid and dexamethasone may given. Other complication of uncontrolled hyperthyroidism, it is heart failure, other than type multi-congestive heart failure, 
maternal hypertension, increased risk of maternal hypertension in the patients with encounter hyperthyroidism noted, a premature labor and growth resection, IUGR, or even cell birth, intihibil IUG. And the only complication uh, for uncontrolled hyperthyroidism. Then, how can manage the patient? We examine the patient and investigate, and the patient diagnose at hyperthyroidism. So, how can, or uh, what the type of drugs our management should be given to the patient? Because of radioactive iodine triglycerides is contraindicated during pregnancy, so the medical treatments is generally employed. احنا كل احنا نعرف مقتيه انتو بالميديسن الهايبرتيروديزم treated either by radioactive iodine or medical treatment or surgical treatment. During pregnancy, because radioactive iodine is teratogenic, so it is contraindicated. راح نستبعده. إذا حيكون المانجمنت حيكون medical treatment. If failed, ممكن نستخدم surgical treatment in rare cases only. بس ال 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 drug of choice أو العفو method of choice for treatment هو medical treatment. ليش؟ لأن radioactive iodine it is contraindicated teratogen وال ويؤدينا إلى fetal hypothyroidism وإضافة المن لل surgical يحمل high mortality rate. Then medical treatment is by propothyroxine. Or by uh, any drugs lead to the carbamazole decrease a titer of TSH receptor antibody. واضح. إيش راح يسوون هذول الاثنين؟ the propothyroxine إلى صفة خاصة أيضا advantage of blocking conversion of T4 to T3. واثنين هاتهم يشتركون. Reduce the titer of TSH receptor antibody, directly influencing the etiology of grave disease. هذا ال benefit من استخدامهم two drugs. هذا عملهم مشترك وهذا العمل blocking convert T4 to T3. هذا عمل أيضا إضافي إنضاف إلى ال propylthiazine إضافة إلى أن decrease the titer of TSH. زين both the drug. Probably cross the placenta in the same proportion, and there's no need to the change from carbamazole to propothyroxine. And to just قارن قبل بعضني غير الحكي إحنا الكتبنا الطبية ب evidence base of Royal College and Doherty. أني كتبنا الأوبستريك ما كدا نحول من من دراجس إلى آخر. نيناتهم نفس النسبة انتقالها وعبرها بلاسنتا للفيتس الكربيمازول بروبوثايورسيل فما كو داعي إذا بيجت نجتنا على الكربيمازول نحولها بروبوثايورسيل Both drugs are equally beneficial and those, those of either can tighter against the maternal well-being and biochemistry إذا نيناتهم الشغل نفس, نفس الإفكاسي نفس السايد إفكت نفس النسبة نيو عبرو بلاسنتا فما كو داعي نغيرهم من من drug to another. Also, both drugs are not teratogen. Okay, antithyroid drug can cause uh, adrenocytosis, rarely may cause fetal goiter and hypothyroidism. So, how can you take or uh, how can you give the drugs? Should use minimal dose required in mother should be therefore be used. يعني هيكون lower effective dose. هاي العبارة تحفظوها. شو ننطي الدوز اللي ننطي للpatient؟ هيكون lower effective dose. أقل دوز يأدينا إلى الإفكاسي اللي إحنا ريت. Effective lower dose. And as usual, aim for a free T4 level are the upper limit of the normal. This is the aim. We can give it a beta blocker given if uh, the patient complains from tachycardia. 
thyroid function test should be done every four to six weeks. And the thiouracil is in breast uh, milk does not exceed 0.025% uh, of the administered daily maternal dose. And no change occur in thyroid function test of a breast feeding weight. حتى during the lactation, برباير ثيروسين راح تقدر نعطي ليش نسبة إنه خروجها بالملك كلش قليل إضافة من من ليش يشوفون ثيروت فونكشن تيست for the new nate اللي هو breastfeed there is no any change ليس الهايبر ولا يصير هايبر ثيروسين فممكن نستخدمه safely the proper thyroid during the lactation period. هاي بالنسبة للميديكال تريتمنت، what about the surgical management؟ it's recommended only if medical treatment fail or goiter is very large and may lead to difficult in the swallowing or difficult in uh, respiration. What type of the surgery? Subtotal thyroidectomy during the pregnancy should be delayed until the second trimester. Why? Because the risk of the spontaneous abortion is highest in the first trimester. What about the effect of Graves syndrome on the fetal thyroid? May lead to the fetal hypothyroidism when maternal thyrotropin receptor stimulating antibodies cross the placenta and they can cause fetal or neonatal thyrotoxicosis. The fetal thyroid is capable of responding to this antibody after 20 weeks. Potential effect should be monitored in the second half of pregnancy by assessment of fetal well being and fetal growth and measuring of the fetal heart rate, which is if more than 160, 160 beer, beer per minute may be in indicate of the fetal thyrotoxicosis. And also ultrasound can be used to exclude any fetal goiter and cardiosynthesis for free T4 and TSH determined can be performed. إذن شو وقت إحنا نتوقع إنه ممكن ممكن ال 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 this antibodies pass from the maternal cir circulation across the placenta to the fetal circulation. ال to after twenty weeks, the baby has been shown can respond to these antibodies, which is known as maternal thyrotropin receptor stimulating antibodies, will act on the fetal thyroid, lead to produce more and more th th thyroxine, adding to fetal tachycardia, IUGR, even IUD, and fetal goiter. شو وقت حيكون suspicion إذا كان الفيتال heart rate high. When we ultrasound for secluded fetal coiter and may need cardiosynthesis for free T4 and TSH to remain in the fetal circulation. So what about the complication of fetal hyperthyroidism? Maybe to the premature delivery, hydros fetalis, nitija to congestive heart failure, death, a fetal coiter may cause also polyhydramia. Why? Because will prevent absorption of the lichen, and also may lead to obstructed labor, also may, may lead to low IQ and therapy by maternal administration of antithyroid drugs plus minor thyroxine, which not to cross the placenta to offset any hypothyroidism effect. What about other subject in this Lecture. It is hypothyroidism. قبل أن خلاص أتكم سؤال عن الهايبرثيرويدزم. أكو سؤال ماما. إن شاء الله ولا هذا السؤال. إن شاء الله. الهايبرثيرويدزم. It occurs one percent of pregnant women. يعتبر نسبة عالية. It is usually due to autoimmune Hashimoto's thyroiditis or idiopathic eczema. 
edema can also occur following treatment of hyperthyroidism and direct pituitary causes will be very rare. إذن أول عرف في البرسنتج نعرف شنو ال underlying cause of hyperthyroidism. The common cause هو the autoimmune. اللي يسمونه هاشيماتوس thyroiditis. أو idiopathic one. This one. Second cause of maternal hyperthyroidism. It is what following the treatment of hyperthyroidism. خاصة دول اللي يتعالجون قبل ال pregnancy بالradioactive iodine. مرات ينتهينا بمن بالhypothyroidism. أو بسبب direct pituitary cause يعني وهذا very rare يعني there is no TSH وبالنتيجة سكرينش باي بيتوتري كوز وبالنتيجة حيكون لو ثايروكسين لابل هاي بالنسبة للكوزات of hypothyroidism what a pregnancy on the appropriate thyroid replacement can expect normal pregnancy outcome نتذكر ان البيشت شو اذا كانت تاخذ appropriate thyroid replacement before a pregnancy فنتوقع ان يكون ال outcome as any normal pregnancy outcome Marco complication, but any treated cases has been associated with an increased risk of spontaneous abortion. ولكن إذا ما علشنا any treated case, أولا risk of spontaneous abortion حيزيد, risk of preeclampsia حيزيد, premature separation of placenta or abruptly placenta حيزيد, low birth weight and stillbirth. أيضا إضافة low IQ. وعادة اللو اكيو مثل ما قلنا وضحت لكم بالفسيولوجيكال تشينجز ان بريجنسي ات از لايكلي تو اكر ان ذا فيرست ترايمستر اند ذير فور بري كونسبشنال اوبتمايزيشن اوف تي فور ثيرابي ات از امبورتنت عادة بالفيرست ترايمستر اتفقنا البرين هيومر ديفلوبمنت يعتمدنا على الماتيرنال ثيروكسين لذلك بالفيرست ترايمستر شود بي بيفور بيشنت بيكم بريجنت يعني بري كونسبشوال should be optimized the T4 therapy. It is very important to make the, the patient eothyroid, not hypothyroid, uh, before coming uh, or become, become pregnant one. Yeah, it is important to the thyroid, thyroxine treatment, when the patient at level, normal level, eothyroid patient, eothyroid, يعني, uh, normal thyroid function test. لازم نسوي optimization before pregnancy وديون the first trimester حتى نضمن إنه normal brain development of the fetus. شو ال clinical feature? Classical symptom of hypothyroidism such as tiredness, constipation, anemia, weight gain, carpal tunnel syndrome, hair change, and are common in pregnancy. صح ولا لا؟ كلنا نشوفه هاي محتمل. Sign and symptom in normal pregnancy, and cannot be replied upon for this discriminate onset or worsening of the disease. كل هذه classical symptoms ممكن نلقاها بال normal pregnancies. Constipation to or for ممكن يكون due to deficiency or progesterone or effect of a pregnancy. Any one ممكن increase the amount weight gain normal pregnancy. Carpal tunnel syndrome ممكن يكون بسبب الفلود. يعني uh, overload زين hair change محتمل قابل normal pregnancy فصفاتها و clinical feature مالت الهايبوثيروديسم ايضا مشتركة مع normal pregnancy زين how can I diagnose by investigation اذا clinical remain نقدر نشخص الهايبوثيروديسم لازم نشخصها by blood test اللي هو important laboratory finding the confirm diagnosis of hypothyroidism راح نلاقي شنو elevated Thyroid stimulating hormone level, TSH high. Other finding, the low level of free serum T3 and free serum T4 حيكون قليل. Okay. What about therapy? Once the diagnosis of the hypothyroidism has been made in a pregnancy woman, thyroid. Thyroid replacement should be started immediately. Minute after, لازم should start the thyroxine by the lipothyroxine in the dose of 0.15 milligram per day is usually sufficient to for this symptom. 
ويكون المانجمنت مال تأمن increase the dose أو decrease the dose according to the uh, levels of the hormones. So the measure therefore based on principally on the biochemical measure مثل ما قلنا لازم يكون investigation هي اللي شخص لنا الحالة thyroxin is tighter for uh, against the biochemical result and safe in the pregnancy and lactation. Thyroxine that may not be patient in no here. All right, which is you know already how my hypothyroidism. Um, already on the thyroxine. Should we consider pregnant to have from the thyroxine to talk about the thyroxine? No, should be reassure the patient the thyroxine. It is safe in pregnancy. Also, it is safe in the lactation period. And it is very important for the mental development and to prevent the complication uh, due to hypothyroidism during the pregnancy. As long as the patient is clinically eothyroid or thyroid function test is normal, okay, should be so monitoring by thyroid function test every two to three months. Then, خليه كل شهر ثلاث تشرين يعني يديلها thyroid function test. Hello, three T four level. Indicate what increase in the therapy rather than the rise in TSH. إيش وقت إحنا راح من تطلع لنا النتائج؟ هنشوف ال TSH, T4, three T4. إذا كان T4 low, should be increase the dose of the thyroxine and the thyroid replacement therapy. Then, fetal hypothyroidism. هل ممكن يصير فيتو هايبوثيرويزم in this case إذا كانت أوتو أنيون؟ نعم. The incidence about incidence of the fetal hypothyroidism about one in four thousand births. Also Hashimoto's hypothyroidism result in the in the auto antibodies crossing the placenta. يعني شنو؟ Aqua auto antibodies cross the placenta. It does not affect the fetal thyroid develop. However, very rarely thyroid S thyroid stimulating hormone receptor blocking antibody can cause a transient hypothyroidism in either fetus or baby. It is mungkin associated with the Hashimoto's hypothyroidism. Aqua antibody خاصة اسمها. Thyroid stimulating hormone receptor blocking antibody. This ممكن تعبر through the placenta. السبب إن transient hypothyroidism either in the fetal period or in baby or يعني in neonatal other delivery. This is transient one should be uh, check the blood in the neonatal. Level from the first day to what to estimate the thyroid function test of the uh, of the unit if need thyroxine or uh, need anti thyroid. What about this lecture? Any questions? Then, احنا شنو عرفنا النقاط المهمة ركز الكوامية physiological change. Use in your thyroid function during the pregnancy management. اعتمدنا على thyroid function test اللي نقيس بي free T3, free T4, وليس total T3 T4 لأنه already total will be increased نتيجة زيادة globulin level. لازم نعرفهم إنه حوالي أربعين بالمية من العتم هايبر من سكراب دايرام عتم اللي بيت T4 محتمل هو Thyroid hormone, but we need anti-thyroid drugs. If the cause malt more hyperthyroidism, Graves disease will common cause of hyperthyroidism. Or the autoimmune disease. Mohtemel the antibodies pass through the placenta and fetus adine to hyperthyroidism. Thyroxine will ill thyroidism period prior to the conception, which is important. To avoid low IQ and for good fetal mental development, early diagnosis of fetal or neonatal hypothyroidism or hyperthyroidism will reduce fetal or neonatal morbidity and mortality. Eothyroidism should be maintained along throughout the pregnancy 
to decrease fetal and maternal morbidity and mort mortality. So for this, will aim to improve the pregnancy outcome. أكو ماما نقطة مهمة أردن أعيد لكم إياها ما فهمتوها لو كله واضح عندكم شيء مو واضح ماما إن شاء الله واضح دكتورة إن شاء الله يلا شكرا جزيلا ماما الحضور شكرا شكرا دكتورة